Nelson Mandela was imprisoned on Robben Island during the 1976 uprising student strike in Soweto. Jacob Zuma was involved in the anti-apartheid struggle during that period but was in exile in Zambia and Mozambique at the time of the uprising. Cyril Ramaphosa was also involved in the anti-apartheid struggle during this time and played a leading role in the labor movement. He was arrested for his activism in 1974 and was in prison. At the time of the uprising, Thabo Mbeki was in exile at the time of the Soweto uprising in 1976. He was serving as the African National Congress ANC, representative in the Soviet Union and the ANC's head of intelligence. Winnie Mandela was in South Africa during the time of the Soweto uprising and was actively involved in the anti-apartheid struggle. She provided support and shelter for activists who were escaping arrest and persecution by the apartheid government. She was arrested and detained without trial several times during this period, including in June of 1976. Shortly after the uprising began, Chris Harney was in Lesotho at the time of the Soweto uprising in 1976. He fled to Lesotho in 1975 after being banned by the apartheid government, and became the chief of staff of the ANC's military wing, Umkanto we Sizwe, in 1983. During his time in exile, Harney played a significant role in the anti-apartheid struggle and helped to organize military operations against the apartheid regime. He returned to South Africa in 1990 after the unbanning of the ANC and began working actively towards the establishment of a democratic South Africa.